Hi, Ms. Seglin here. Today I'm going to be talking about how to access Microsoft Teams. This is an app in Office 365. Okay, so all you're going to do is get into your school email, however you usually do, and it's the Outlook app, if you can't remember, and you're going to log in, you know, for 7th grade, 25, last four, of your last name, first four of your first name, at gslions.net, and your password obviously is your lunch number. Okay, so you're going to find the email from your teacher who has added you to Teams. So this is just a sample that I've set up just to show you. Um, please know this week, the week of March 30th, this is just pra practice work. It is not graded. However, it would be good for you to try some of it um, and to get on Teams so you're prepared for April 6th when the online work will be graded. Now, of course, this is new to everybody. People will be there to help you. Do not get stressed. Okay, and even Teams is new to me. I'm just trying this out. And again, this is just what I'm doing at first. We might change it if we find a better way of doing this. Okay, so we're on the email. Okay, so I've clicked the email. And now I'm going to click on Open Microsoft Teams. Okay, so there's a button on my computer. It's saying Open Microsoft Teams. Now there is a web, a Windows app, or I can use the web app instead. Okay, I'm just going to use the web. So now I'm in the actual team here. Okay, again, this is a sample. That's why I have one person in it. Um, and I'm going to go to assignment. So it says view assignment. Okay, it says due March 30th. That would be tomorrow. Okay, so I can give a reaction. I want to give a sad face. Okay, so yours might look slightly different because again, this is a sample. So I'm going to click on my name. Okay, so there's directions and I see, okay, read the next direction of the giver. Now there, are, I did re-record the entire The Giver book, which is on YouTube. Um, and then Mrs. Frederick found a PDF of the entire book, which is really cool, which you can also use. So you have the online book or the audio. You can do both. You can pick one. Okay, and then you're going to read these discussion questions. Okay, so now I'm clicking. Okay, I want to edit this document. Okay, I'm going to edit in the browser because I don't want to maybe download the the web app. If you're using a school computer that's borrowed, you probably are, you may not be able to install um, an app on those. So again, that's a good option if you can't. Okay, however, maybe I can type on this. Okay, I can type on this. So I'm just going to type my answers in complete sentences right here in the document. Okay. I know the answers because I've read this book many times. Okay, but again, I'm going to restate the question. Okay, and then I would put my answer here. Okay, so again, that's typed. And I think in the other document, I did number those for you. But again, if that bothers you, just go in. You, you have the power to edit this document. Okay. Um, one nice thing, if you're using a home computer, maybe you have a mouse, something we typically don't have at school, so that's a plus. Okay, so Jonas was selected to be the, okay, I'm not going to give that away if you didn't get there yet. Okay, and I'd put my answer there, okay? So now I can define these vocabulary words. How do I do that? Okay, I can always get this thing called a dictionary, or I could go online. I could, you know, go to dictionary.com, and I could paste it, successor here. I can listen to the pronunciation, okay. 
And I think the meaning, this is the meaning in the giver. Okay, so I'm going to get back. Now, I actually did download the uh, team, so I do have the app. So I could just, it's going to make me do control V. Make sure clicking on it. Okay, so there I was able to just copy and paste those in. I'm going to read these words in again. Crescendo, maybe I don't know how to pronounce that. That's okay. You know, maybe I want to go back to the web. And I want to listen to that. Then I'm going to crescendo. Okay, I'm going to use that. Okay, so use what you need. And then if there are any words as you are listening you don't know, then you are going to type them here put the page number if you can okay and then this is just our journals we've been doing so Jonas has not been selected nor assigned um, this is where your quote would be you know use your quotation marks type that up and then the analysis what's the difference what physical trait does he have in common with the current receiver so this is where you're gonna explain after you're done it's time to take the quiz I'm hitting control and I'm clicking on forms. It's going to take me to the test. You can use the book. Okay, you can refer back to that PDF. Okay, and then when you are finished, you need to hit submit. Okay, if you don't hit submit, then I cannot see your grade. Okay, those are 10 points. They're open book. So, you know, take your time. Um, now, one thing when I am done with this okay you could say I didn't understand I don't know number four okay alright so when you hit return you're submitting that okay so that was a you know assigned and then you have returned it okay so then I would go in on my end and then be able to grade it I don't know okay if you are going to get an email when that happens I'm not sure okay so again that is just a sample Thank you to Domain S for letting me use your account. I'm going to turn that back over to you and make sure when I'm using somebody's account that I sign out and that I am off all of this. Okay? So again, just play around with it. You know, do your best, follow the directions and um, you know, if you have any issues, definitely you can throw something up. There's a chat feature on the assignments or as always send an email. Okay. So hopefully everybody is able to at least get on teams. And I think that would be a good goal. Okay. Thanks for listening.